Oh, there's no sound. Um, I think I know why, and it's because of a Windows update. I can fix that pretty quickly. Thanks, Windows. Excellent. Seventy-two. Oh yeah, so we're up to this. I'm not gonna enjoy playing this. I'm gonna try to find some capes before going in there again. I think one of these levels is like an easy and pretty close cape farm now. Ever since I got the green switch. So if you hit this from the side, you get a cape. But uh, hmm. hit it in the side with what? Whatever. This is a pretty easy cape. So I guess I can get my first cape here and my second cape over there. farther. So, this looks to be a giant fucking maze with shit hidden behind the, you know, the things, which is why I brought the cape. I'm just gonna like fucking spin indiscriminately and assume there's, there's motherfuckers behind every single one of them. Subgroup. Uh, so the reason I'm moderating this is because it was updated, but not in terms of like level design or anything. Uh, it was not console compatible, largely or entirely because of uh, the tool that was used to add custom music, not adding music that was compatible with accurate emulators or the actual Super Nintendo. And somebody fixed that and uploaded an update. And I'm re-moderating it. And so I'm not critiquing like the level design or the other things that moderation normally critiques. Uh, just like whether it it works on accurate emulator. In my case, my Super NT. Okay, so the switch opened this up for me. Motherfucker down here? No. That's surprising. Let's build a bridge. Okay. Oh, and 
another one. Love building bridges. And how far back do I have to go to get over there? I forgot to spin, you piece of shit. Well, that's one of my capes gone. Fuck. I gotta, I gotta spin to kill the motherfuckers. I can't. I can't forget. I'm gonna get hit. Fuck. Hmm. I might as well take this now. I swear to god, there's a fucking pit behind one of these. Ah! Uh, there's a magic Koopa. What the fuck is this turning into? Do I... Do I need him to do something for me? What's up here? I do need him. I need him to excavate a path up there. Maybe, by the looks of it. Yes, sir. Very cooperative. Let's go with that. Let's go with that. My cape is gone. I can't spin the motherfuckers anymore. Fuck. Mm. I, I saw him. There's a motherfucker behind there. Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't have time for this shit. Time for this shit. Give me a checkpoint. Bro. Sup one shot, zombie. No, it's not. I'm almost running out of time to be careful here, which I, I really, like, that displeases me. No, you fucking don't. Oh my god, yes. Yes. Okay. That was unpleasant, but surprisingly easy. This is a jam. Alright, I think we're back to like just platforming and shit here. level design motif. Oh, fucking what? Uh, that's not solid, right? This my jump. Uh, I think I'm gonna get some capes for that. <laughs> Let's 
Is it here? No, actually. This guy never becomes throwable. I thought for whatever reason he acted like a Galumba if you stun him. I think some of the crab sprites do that, but not this one. That's a Paraga, thank you. the capes count. <laughs> they fucking did wonders on the ghost house. <laughs> Alright. Can I fly over the fucking level? Oh, that's a bad fucking start. Never mind, it's fine. Motherfucker. Oh, holy shit. There's a lot going on. Okay, I'm like exactly in the same position I started now. <laughs> yeah, that's the, the universal indicator for the level being good. Oh shit, H. So I can go, that wasn't bad. Last words. All right, what's going on in the second half? <laughs> Whatever, that's fine. That's what I'm hoping. Um, so far, both the most difficult and most unpleasant level has been the, the ghost chip for me. Which I actually haven't seen the original version of, because it's not required, and every person I've seen play Lose Adventure has just, like, skipped it. <laughs> uh, but that took me an hour, and I think nothing on the required path has taken me that long since. this way. Oh, they're homing. Don't like that. Oh, it's the generator. It's the diagonal generator. Fuck. That's mean. Kinda maybe take off with cape here, but it would be like a pain in the ass. Oh wait, you can do it here a lot, a lot more easily. I might just fly over this fucking level if it, <laughs> if it becomes too, too tedious. Oh, there's nothing up there, just the motherfucker. Thank you. 
I mean, we're the mods, so we can do whatever we want. Um, as long as there's a, a reasonable belief that it, it's not going to affect the level design. But nobody's complained to me about it yet. And the section, mo uh, the section managers are well aware that I've been doing this forever. And it's not just with Fix Me Hacks, it's with like pretty much all hacks. Um, I just have to keep an eye on, like, the difficulty of the hack and the availability of life farms. What is this? Okay, not a cape. And, like, if it's really hard and there are no lives, um, even if I'm using infinite lives, I will call out, like, a lack of lives. Because I'm cognizant of whether I would have gotten a game over um, had I not had infinite lives. Game overs aren't fun, which is the whole reason I started patching this in in the first place. Fuck, that's a it's gonna be a tough takeoff. Maybe that's not the takeoff spot. Yeah. Wait a second. My fucking flight meter. Okay, your flight meter stays, but that looks like a really tough transition there. Dang. And look out for somewhere we can take off. Yeah, I mean, if you want, I, uh, I don't know how interested anybody is in his hacks outside of Luigi's Adventure. Wow, that's a fucking Kuso bullet if I've ever seen one. I think most people are playing the Luigi's Adventure games for the culture. Um, and I don't know how much his other hacks have contributed to the the collective culture of Super Mario World. Hey, this fucking sucks. God damn. Shoved him. Smilers. Shoved him knows exactly what she's here for and she's about to get it.
let's let's try this again. <laughs> No, that's that's borderline impossible, I would say. Fuck. Flying over definitely seems to be the move, like, if I could fucking manage it. Sub Zephyrus. The other option is... bringing Cape somewhere. Like, holding it in reserve until then. Like, Hyper 6 Abyssal Bowser style. And then deploying it where it would get me, like, through the rest of the level easily. If such a place even exists, it, it may not. on the saw. I wouldn't be surprised. It wasn't even the saw that bothered me, I just got spooked probably by the fucking bullet bills. sucks. I think I've almost always gotten hit there. stream banter. These fucking ledges suck because, like, the graphics jut, jut out a tile, but there isn't actually ground there. That's caused me a few deaths in, like, every level with this tile set also. Oh, there's, there's death there, okay. There's gotta be, like, fucking five just clean tiles without bullshit somewhere in this level for me to get flight off of. But probably not. Because <laughs> fuck me. A bullet's always there. Well, I don't know about always, it's there a lot. No! No! Stop! Fucking stop! Said stop it! <laughs> There's so much shit! There's so much shit! Try it again. That's what I thought was gonna happen. Fucking bullets. Fucking KP isn't worth shit here. God damn it. Oh yeah, Shubda, while you're here, and before I forget, um, I would like you to play the Sunken Ghost Ship and the original Luigi's Adventure. This is a level I don't think you've played because it's optional. 
And the reason I want you to play it is because I played it in this game, because I'm playing all the exits. And so far, it was the worst level in this hack. So far. So I'm... I'm curious to see what it's like in the original. I'm hoping it's worse. There's the shit bullet. Oh, leave me alone. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Fuck, I had a good round too. Neat. Yeah, so so let, let me know like if you if you need something for it or or if you're just gonna do an old friend a favor. It took me an hour to beat it in this version, just for like, as a benchmark. Good. Excellent. Excellent. What world is it in? Let me just show you in this overworld. Uh, it's it's in the same overworld position. And I'll maybe go and get some capes on the way back. Um, here it is. So it's it's this thing. So like if you get, I guess, the secret exit or one of the exits, whichever exit goes left in this level, like it takes you here and, and this acts as a, an alternate path to uh, this thing. Hyper six safe died. You gotta, you gotta be diligent. You gotta like back your shit up and get the SD cards without the stupid right notches, so your your SD card doesn't accidentally get right locked when you insert it into your thing. I used to have that problem. I don't have that problem anymore. God damn it. <sighs> Fuck you. Fuck you too. Can I take off here? Well, it's probably gonna fuck me when I try. <sighs> okay, so it's possible to actually gain flight here, but then the saws. I guess I could try using backwards fly to like fly straight up. That would involve me learning how to do that again because I think it's been too long and I'd have to relearn it. But honestly, maybe learning Cape Tech again is easier than playing this fucking level legit. <laughs> like the fucking first part was free and then there's this shit. Yep. That's good. That's good. dead there is no way to avoid that shit <sighs> I have no plan I have no plan for how I'm gonna beat this level
maybe this should just be like a backwards fly practice stream and then when I get it again I'll just go back and beat this using using the level transition fly. No. Fuck out of here. I remember where it is. Um, I don't. I would check Lunar Magic, so I guess you could just do that. Although, if it comes to me, I'll let you know. Cognitive power is being wasted by this fucking sprite spam of a level. Oh my fucking god. It's ter absolutely fucking terrifying. Like, I guess an alternate use for the cape would be spin to win the the sprite spam. And just not try to fly with it. I wonder if that's worth trying. Wait until he fires the homing bullet, then go here full speed, then you might... Get out of here without taking fucking damage. Yep. Yep. This is a PB. That shoots diagonally despite the graphics being... Despite the graphics being sideways. Oh boy. Oh boy. Maybe that was it. Maybe that was the place to drop my cape. Although I would have had to get down, uh, get over there small only, which I didn't do. I got the mushroom, then I took a hit, which is why I was small, and then died. sure you can fly over the whole level based on the part that I died at, but you could fly over like a big swath of it at least. Oh, so much for that.
No. Let me... If you get trapped in there, like, it's, it's basically all over. It's real fucking bad if you get trapped there. Also, if possible, you want to set up this dag and a launcher to fire, like, when you're moving to the right. Then you can just, like, kind of chill and stand still. You don't want it to fire at you if you're, like, standing on the block. That's... That's stationary because it becomes real fucking hard to dodge. Yeah, what's up, sounds like? Thank you for the reset. And the luck. This level is kind of fucked up. the way to go. Delay it until you're, you can go to the right. <sighs> Am I fucking safe here? Alright, I can take a breather here. So this would be the place to drop a power up if I had one in reserve. Excellent. Oh yeah, shoved him. Memories flooding back in. Good sprite. <laughs> Have you um, been watching Amethyst play OSC, rather, three OSC? Like, in some ways, it's fucked up in, like, new ways that you haven't seen in Luigi's Adventure 1. But also, there's, like, literally copy and pasted segments, like, entire rooms from the first one, which I find odd and comical. I'm fucking dead. Oh, wow. I'm surprised I survived that, but not that. Like some of the sections that I recognize, like they're from they're from the original Luigi's Adventure one, not OSC. <laughs> like in OSC, there's this part with uh, precision maneuvering between thwomps and roto discs, and in the original, there's a very similar section, but instead of roto discs, you have ball and chains because roto disc is a custom sprite, which the original didn't have.
made me curious about like the timeline of the development for all these hacks. It's like Annie Kitty had a bunch going at the same time. Like out of order. Finished some, not others. here until the the thing fires so we can avoid it with higher likelihood okay fuck you fuck 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 there's a fucking cape here Am I safe here? Oh no. No! <laughs> oh my god, this would have been free with cape because you can just you can just you can just float. But it's not free anymore. So I lost the fucking cape. Can go. Fuck. <sighs> oh, it's the same song. I'm just gonna assume that this kills you. Also, this is ample takeoff room, and this dude either kills himself or I'm pretty sure you can just kill him. Fuck with a cape spin if you need to. Let's see how bad this is. Yeah, what's up, glitch? Thank you. What the? What the fuck even killed me? All right. Oh, it's the uh, the extended sprite that he drops. All right. Didn't see those guys. They were hiding. Fuck. It, these ledge graphics, like that that fucking ledge, there's there's nothing there, even though it looks like there is. Hmm. Oh my god. You can spin jump on the Fire Bros fireballs at least. Necessarily a viable speed strat. Oh my god, what is this emote? <laughs> Warp. Amazing. Maybe if I bounce on the piranha plant's right side, I'm committed to making this work. Zaplex, thank you. Yeah. Now you get killed by this guy. Fucking hell. Ah, oh, the capes are getting farther and farther away. There's no there's no cape farm that I recall in this world. This guy has good aim. I don't like how good his aim is. Underball. What? I can't even see what the fuck. Mm. 
Yeah. I know he hit a bunch of shit there in the um, in the original game, but it wasn't it wasn't those dudes because those dudes are custom sprites. I wonder if you can go over them. I think I noticed free vertical scrolling, which is helpful for climbing with Kate. A lot of level design down there. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh, okay. No, it's cool. I'm standing. I'm standing on this. Do the same shit here. No, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get destroyed by this first potabo. I know it.
Of course. Oh, this sucks. Looks like another good level. Alright, you're safe here though, and you're probably also safe like right under here. So that's fine. Um, he's gonna... Scrolling really helps with the supers. Yeah, this doesn't seem terrible with like strats and being careful. section for you. Alright, almost. Underball. Dude. He's on top of a slope. Maybe I should just use a uh, slide kill to get rid of his footballs. That may be the better solution. My dude. Fuck you. No. Alright, alright. Hasty. Yeah, I know you're a big fan of it. You made that that entire level with floating and butt slide. Um, yeah, I've been trying to be more cognizant of like when I can use it to my advantage. This hack, for all its cruelty, is a big fan of like slopes and stairs and shit that you can slide up and down to kill almost anything. I've been trying to take full advantage of it. That was risky, but whatever.
This is a PB. We can chill here for a moment. Oh, didn't see that. Oh, and I'm dead. All right. This seems less terrible than the previous level. I guess there's just like less shit coming at you at the same time. You can sort of just focus on one or two things here. Is he despawned? I think he's despawned. Yo, what's up, Spud? Thank you. We're, we're getting... Uh, I guess we're not even getting into this shit now. I know what this shit looks like. <laughs> we're not even there yet, and I'm already having a bad time. <sighs> Alright. Now I see that that fucking... Spike is there. Bad situation. Why are they red? Did I? Did they hurt me, or did this the spike top hurt me? The spike top's going the other way. I don't see any way I can traverse that obstacle without like stepping on it. I can't ride the spike top over. So I want to say I died to the spike top and not the blocks. If I die to the blocks, then I've got some thinking to do. So I don't actually know how to how to win there. The spike top killed me. Okay. Oh, that's a homing launcher. I want to get that off screen as soon as fucking possible. Well, homing like. Shitty homing. Not the the real bad homing. Oh, this guy's a, a real fucking dick. Okay. Oh, thanks. Fuck you. Is that it? Did I see a cherry to my right? I did. That's a fucking cherry. Okay, how do I not die and get this? Yes, let's fucking go. Is there some shit behind here? What is that? Okay, it's just... Just a star in the background, I guess. Thought Annie Kitty was hiding some shit there. Oh, yes, bud. Yeah, it does. Right, what's over here? Thanks. I hate it. Regular jump, maybe. Oh, that's a bad one. He's got very good aim. That's that's a tough one. Yo, yeah, what's up, Myth? Um, we flew over a level earlier, Spud. It was the one before this, the second half, I think. No, it was, it was the whole last level. Yeah. It was like, this game has capes and I have unlocked a number of cape farms. What? Ah, these fucking ledges. one that I like tried to fly over but failed and had to do it legit. That was giving me a real bad time. <sighs> That's a shitty spike graphic. I really have to concentrate and look out for that to not hit it.
Don't. Don't fucking do it. isn't that bad if you can just bounce off the, the shit. Right, this this kind of fucking sucks. Alright, use use my iframes to my advantage. <laughs> oh, get out of here. Oh no. I am very bad at rope Kaizo, which is what this is. Real fucking bad at Rope Kaiser. Oh no, dude. Oh no. I think we're gonna have to play with the capes again. This version has the section that's like 54 rope jumps in a row or whatever the fuck it is for one of the exits in the level. I'm pretty sure I saw Shove Dead Rambo both nope out of that and do the other path, which also sucks. Um, what's here if you have cape? I don't want that. No, can I? Well, PB, simply because I could take more hits. Jesus fucking Christ. What's up, Rambo? Thanks for the luck. Yeah, no, I think I'm going to try to... Try to do room transition fly and see if I can fly over the level there. I didn't, I didn't see any other great place to take off. Thank you for a belated birthday. This game's gotten to the point where I'm uh, concocting strats to like fly over late game levels. Thank you, Spud. How much of the final level you can fly over? All right. enough. Might take a while. Alright. 
time to channel manor Pogio. This is the speed that we want. All right, I'm standing on this thing. There is hope. We have hope. <laughs> oh my god, I fucking barely got to this thing. Well, let me win. I hope the goal isn't... No, that's the rope section, dude. I, <laughs> no. The rope section is down there. You... Mm, fuck, you can't cheat it with Kate. <sighs> ah, there's so much shit down there, dude. Fuck. This is big unfortunate. Fuck, dude. Plan B, scrolling. Oh, that was a fucking awful idea. I <sighs> I mean, cape helps even if you can't fly with it. Like, I'm also wondering if it's possible to fly under the rope section. Hmm. I wonder if that's worth a shot. Because it was all pretty high up, if I recall. Just gotta get lucky once with the ropes. Yeah. You like almost certainly have to kill the chuck. Serving of Cape Cheese, I don't think. Excuse you? I'm giving my shit back. Oh, fuck you. Well, now we're having a real bad fucking time. I don't think I've ever even survived this section small because of this asshole. Yeah, whatever. part of the playthrough where I'm plotting like very elaborate cape cheese to get past the levels they're getting pretty rough
Alright, so we can skip the shitty blue piranha plant by flying. That's kind of useful. Whatever, just take off here again. Fuck. Mm, but then I miss out on this fire flower. It's very high. I think it's just like on top of the level. Never mind. Well, at least we get the, the back of Fire Flower here. Uh, let's roll with this for now, I guess. I'm gonna need Cape later. Try left scroll. I'm not gonna be able to react to shit. That's not case in point. Uh, my, my fucking reserve power up is gone. I'm dead. There's no fucking way I'm gonna survive this. That part is ass. I need to try to fly over that. Maybe I can get flight by going like up and down the slope where the chuck hangs out after killing the chuck. Because after that, it's rope time. There's no more takeoff opportunities after that. Hey, this is an interesting glitch. I mean, the block invisible. forgot about that shit. Oh, I... Bro. Fuck this game. Imagine being in this much of a hurry to get to fucking world nine. All right, there's there's a motherfucker there. Don't don't touch him. That doesn't usually line up that way, but okay, I guess. Pick up our backup flower.
Okay, go fuck yourself. All right. Is flight possible through here? I don't know if I can take off as possible, honestly. It's a big doubt from me, dog. Big doubt. Oh, no, I did. That was by taking a hit. Yeah, I think I'm giving up on the cape for a few attempts. Spud. We might have to go the intended route. I have no fucking means of killing this asshole now. Great. I think the largest advantage to having a power-up through there, well, of having a power-up that's not a mushroom, is you can kill that fuck. Oh, you can one-cycle this if you're fast. This asshole. I guess like that, you just just fucking skip him. Just fucking skip him. And then miss the rope. the one cycle. So you wait for him to fire, then get the fuck out before he fires again. Okay. Alright. And then you don't miss the fucking okay,
Wait for him to fire. Fuck off. Skip. Fuck. <sighs> so what? What? You gotta be. You gotta be on the bottom. Gotta be on the bottom of the rope. Okay. Need to jump earlier there. Always get hit by that. That's the only problematic section with that part of this rope part. Fuck, need to jump over that one. Alright, I gotta do the rope section. I think it's gonna take longer to try to fly through. when it's off sync like this. doing that all of a sudden. Jump earlier to survive there. Yikes. I panicked, although I saw I saw the end of the ropes. I don't know if that's like the end of the section or if there's more rope after that. But I saw it. Real fucking good to have a power up there. So you can at least fuck up once without dying. Dude. Don't 
don't touch crystal. There's been a few levels in this world where, like, the first section is whatever, and the second one is absolutely fucked. It's a weird level design. That's the first time I've gotten through there. Uh, hitless. Please, for the love of fuck. <laughs> I love how it's not over. Do I need that? Bro, are you fucking kidding me right now? <laughs> I guess I'll fucking die. There's a fucking pipe there. Hey. Hey, what's in the pipe? Fun fact, this name's... This, uh, this level's number is F in the game. There's never been a more appropriate fucking level number in the history of SMW ROM hacking. <sighs> ah, and that, that, that pipe that I saw was a reset pipe, so I did not have to die. I just had to know that there was a fucking pipe at the bottom of the level. Very informative. Thanks. Thanks, Andy Kitty. Jesus Christ. Well, let's do it again. Maybe we can uh, remember the rope strats that, that got us to victory without taking a single hit. That's some optimistic thinking. the fucking fire flower. That's okay. There's a reset. Except it's not there. I followed some coins and the reset wasn't there. I'm gonna have to get real good at the ropes. Like, not take a single hit, good. I 
but the first rope section is free at least. It's the second one that that's still like that panics me. Three times in a row. <laughs> Glitch. Very good. Oh, there's shit everywhere. No. Uh, uh, please be a reset pipe. <laughs> Fuck. What the fuck is this game gonna turn into in the final world? This is not even the final world. Oh my god. I should just like look in Lunar Magic before I, I lose the well, right after I lose the fucking Fire Flower every time to try to get it back. Try to like fall in the fucking unmarked pipe. Okay, for example, <laughs> where am I? Okay, there should be one like, no, no, this is the wrong place. Oh no, this is the right place. There should be one like right down here. Yeah, reset pipe. Okay. I think the timer resets too. It's not bad. Where am I? There should be one right under here. Yep, timer and everything resets. You have infinite tries as long as you get into those reset pipes. Are they there in the original? Wouldn't be surprised if they weren't. Where am I? Oh, I don't know if I can make this one actually. Uh, I can maybe make the one over here. <sighs> oh, oh! Well, we're going back in the pipe. Oh shit, I have two mushrooms because I, I had one and I fell in a pit with it. Never mind, I have one mushroom again. All is as as should be.
no resets in the original. Oh my fucking god. Annie Kitty. Annie Kitty, what the fuck? Get a fire flower, I guess. I don't know how much it's gonna do for me, even. <laughs> oh, well, actually, that that's pretty helpful. <laughs> now that I remember that that guy is a fucking menace. Except, apparently you can grab fucking ropes. God. Uh, whatever. It doesn't, doesn't really matter. <laughs> like, I can't, I can't kill this guy though. But whatever. I got scratched. That doesn't involve killing him. Ah! Uh, it still might be okay if I just remember how to do the rope section correctly. I'm flailing. I'm flailing. Managed to eke it out. Well, getting here isn't a problem, so I can at least, like, learn this. And I'm gonna have to. And the fact that you can only shoot two fireballs at a time here is profoundly fucked up. Working as intended. And it's great that this is one of those like classic Japanese hack sections like this this in in and of itself, it really is enough to like warrant, you know, a go. I wonder what, what that coin guide if that's what the coin guide means. That there's a platform down here in case you want to spin jump on the saw and do everything blind. Like, this is that type of, of section that, like, <clears throat> warrants a goal, but no. It's one of those levels that's like, oh, it's not over yet. Oh, and actually, the second part is pretty difficult, and you, you gotta, like, actually learn it. Alright, I can say with a high degree of confidence that I've learned the rope section. Which is good, because I gotta learn this now. there. Oof. <laughs> and there's some fucking ASM I just noticed where Luigi does not shoot fire when he's spinning. Or I guess maybe it's because I already have fireballs like Deployed, and there's a limit of two. I wonder. I wonder which it is. Would any kid be that fucking evil? Let's test! Okay, no, he's not. It's- I just had too many deployed. Wouldn't that be some shit, though? Free Kaiser level idea for someone.
with that in your Kaizo hack? Uh, in what context? I finally missed it. Oh, okay. Yeah, someone should do TV Mean. Like Luigi's Adventure 5 should, <laughs> should have it. The fact that I'm about to have double fire flower is not lost on me. But uh, the question is whether I can reclaim the one that I have in reserve when I lose this one. And if I want to rely on that, I might have to play this room scroll to the right. I don't know if it's going to make things harder either. What's up, Truman? Oh, it's a toxic. Yeah. You know what? Let's let's fucking go for it. Nope. Still have to not die. Still have to not fall in a fucking pit. This doesn't have pianos in it? No, it doesn't. The piano boss is like one of the few things that I would... I would not play if I could get out of playing this. <laughs> like, there, there's a lot of things I would rather play than this, but that's not one of them. Truman is, is trying to do the, what is it, I want to kill the Camellia 3 piano boss. You can, like, link a video in chat if you want. Shit looks fucked. Wait, no. I can get two fire flowers whenever I want by going into the reset pipes. I should just make use of this. I shouldn't try to do the level small. Also, there's like a second one right here. Yeah, I got fire too, motherfucker. Fuck you. Although, make no mistake, Truman, this is still pretty fucked. <sighs> Don't even need to grab the fire flower. Got fucking two. Alright, let's, let's scroll to the right. So that we can reclaim it if... Nope. Every time I scroll to the right, I've fallen into that fucking pit. <sighs> I think the, what is it, the, the Ryu boss from Street Fighter? Not in that game, but in Bashi, or I want to be the guy or something. I think that's my favorite one, just because, like, how over the top it is. Oh my 
god, I did that basically blind. Do I need to jump here? No, I didn't fucking think so. Need to jump here though. Oh, fuck. I have not fucked up this part for a hot minute. I didn't need to jump here either, do I? No, okay. Fewer inputs aren't as good. Alright, so... Nope. Nope. My memory has failed me. fucking hit me before. I didn't do the strat. Fuck, I'm getting bad at the rope section. This does not bode well. <sighs> um, I'm simultaneously, like, kind of upset, but also... There's, there's good about it that um, a bunch of the, like, real impressive advancements in SMW ROM hacking tech are due to SA1. Because that means, you know, it can't be played by a few groups of people, like people with EverDrives or Super NTs without SD to SNES. But, like, at the same time, hopefully that will caused users of those systems to apply some pressure to those vendors to get them to implement SA1 support. Universal SA1 would be real fucking cool. Because there's some stuff I wanted to do even in my hack that would have required SA1 and I chose not to because it would have uh, made it less accessible. Also, the SNES Classic, I have no idea if it supports SA1 for, like, ROM hacks. Great. I know it has it in general, because it has, like, some SA1 games on it, but... I know it's also a shitty emulator, so... Why did this fucking thing hit me last time? I spawned it wrong, I guess. It's the only explanation. Okay, we go we go down there and that's how we live, right? Can't be getting rusty at the ropes. Every fucking time, holy shit. For whatever reason, I've not gotten past that section, I don't think. If I were to try to attempt the original, it would take me, like, 
a Storks tier amount of time. I got shoved to agree to um, play what I'm, I'm gonna guess is a pretty fucked up level in the original. It's the sunken ghost ship level, which I haven't seen anyone play. And I asked her to do it because it, it was, until this level, it was my least favorite. Fuck. I don't know, it might still be my least favorite, although this is harder now. Can't wait to see what, what the original looks like. Cool. Can't fuck up the ropes now. Didn't fuck up the ropes. Time to fuck this up, though. <laughs> <laughs> gonna hit me because I spawned it wrong. Top that today. Let's go out on a high note. 
Yeah, no, no. That's enough adventuring for me today. Uh, I'll try to come back tomorrow and adventure more. Uh, yeah, I wanna, I can't like keep taking super long breaks in between playing this thing because this requires a high degree of gameplay. So hopefully see y'all tomorrow. Thanks for hanging out for adventures. Peace.